Holy cow! is an exclamation of surprise used mostly in the United States, Canada, Australia and England. It is a minced oath or euphemism for Holy Christ. Holy cow! dates to at least 1905. The earliest known appearance of the phrase was in a tongue-in-cheek letter to the editor, a lover of the cow writes to this column to protest against a certain variety of Hindu oath having to do with the vain use of the name of the milk producer. These profane exclamations, holy cow, and, by the stomach of the eternal cow. The phrase was used by baseball players at least as early as 1913 and probably much earlier. The phrase appears to have been adopted as a means to avoid penalties for using obscene or indecent language and may have been based on a general awareness of the holiness of cows in some religious traditions. From the Dictionary of American Slang, expressions such as holy buckets, holy underwear, etc. also employ a play on words, holy implying riddled with holes. Paul Beale, however, in revising Eric Partridge's A Dictionary of Catchphrases, British and American, from the 16th century to the present day cites a different origin, holy cow, became associated with several baseball broadcasters. Harry Caray, who was the broadcaster for the St. Louis Cardinals, Oakland Athletics, Chicago White Sox, and Chicago Cubs, began using it early in his career, in order to prevent himself from lapsing into vulgarity. He explained the details in his autobiography, which was co-written with Bob Verdi and titled Holy Cow. New York Yankees shortstop and announcer for Rise Zuto was also well known for the phrase. When the Yankees honored Scooter Rise Zuto decades after he retired, the ceremony included a real cow with a halo prop on its head. 1950s Milwaukee Braves broadcaster El Gillespie was also known for this expression. The phrase may have originated with reporter and broadcaster Halsey Hall, who worked in Minneapolis from 1919 until his death in 1977. According to Paul Dixon, New Orleans radio announcer Jack Holliday also used the phrase on broadcasts of the minor league New Orleans Pelicans in the 1930s. The cartoon strip Common Grounds was originally titled Holy Crulers, a play on this catchphrase. See also, Cattle in Religion. References <laughs>